We live in a time where specialized AI technologies enable us to develop lethal autonomous weapons. Lethal autonomous weapons really means weapons that are meant to kill humans without a human intervention. Lethal autonomous weapons could locate, identify, and kill their targets without any input from a person. These weapons would react too fast for a human to maintain meaningful control. They could be mass-produced and programmed to target innocent civilians of a specific ideology, and they could be made small enough to enable the assassination of any political leader. AI technologies cannot capture human judgments and ethical rules that are essential in making decisions concerning life and death. Thousands of AI researchers from around the world agree. We must take the opportunity to ban lethal autonomous weapons now. Once we have decided collectively it's not morally acceptable to use the technology, that is the first step to ridding the world of this horror. Current AI is too stupid to really have the sort of understanding of uh, the social context, the psychological context, uh, and, and even you know, more generally, human morality. So if you want an AI that can play uh, a game or can recognize objects and images, we can do that. That, that, that's possible, but there's nothing that gives human-like judgment or intelligence. I think it's really dangerous to assume that automation is in fact more objective or more clean or you know more life-saving as people often claim. It is still impossible for a computational system to be able to identify in a situated context what constitutes a valid target. We can't build autonomous weapons that follow international humanitarian law, and they would let us scale warfare in a way, industrialized warfare in a way, that can only be compared to other weapons of mass destruction. One programmer could do what previously took thousands of soldiers to do. Once they're out, then it's going to be much easier for small actors, not, not even governments necessarily, to uh, use them in nefarious ways which could have an impact on democracy, freedom of speech. Artificial intelligence systems, when exposed to new kinds of inputs, they tend to behave in very unpredictable ways. So if we start seeing that on the battlefield, which is one of the most chaotic and unpredictable environments that you could imagine, and where your enemies are actively trying to fool you know, and subvert your systems, we don't know what will happen. If we proceed with lethal autonomous weapons, we make our own worst nightmare come true. Unlike nuclear, biological, or chemical weapons, lethal autonomous weapons can be developed cheaply, with easy-to-find materials, and they can more easily be hacked or fall into the wrong hands. All systems are broken often, right? This is why it takes you know, massive numbers of engineer and data center staff for all of these large companies to maintain operations because these things break, because complex systems are fallible. If you're trying to secure a system, you must be successful every single time, every single minute of every single day. You must be successful in securing that system against everything. If you are attacking that system, you only need to be successful once, and now the system has been breached. We need to ban lethal autonomous weapons immediately before the arms race becomes irreversible. It's not just common sense to ban machines that can decide to kill humans. It's essential for the sake of international security. I'm not worried that a ban will hinder research. In fact, I'm worried that if we don't have a ban, it will hinder research. That the technology was stigmatized and all the good things, even the good things that the military can use AI, like clearing minefields and dropping supplies into contested territory, those won't happen because the public will turn against the use of the technology in all aspects of our lives. And if we don't put a ban, then uh, there could easily be a backlash in the public opinion against AI research in general. Artificial intelligence should be used to save and to improve lives. I use artificial intelligence to program robots that can help people with chronic illnesses have a better quality of life. If we want artificial intelligence to be a force for good in the world, we need to ban bad uses of AI. We need to stop weaponizing this technology. I'd like the UN to negotiate a ban on lethal autonomous weapons. I support a ban on lethal autonomous weapons. We need to ban lethal autonomous weapons immediately. I support a ban on lethal autonomous weapons. We should all oppose lethal autonomous weapons.
we must take the opportunity to ban lethal autonomous weapons, and we must ensure AI is used to create a better world.